It would take giant tugboats okay. a month of constant pulling to put the continents back together. Okay, these tugboats need reactor outputs on the order of petawatts. That is to say, millions of nuclear reactors running flat out just to begin nudging a continental plate. Not to mention the water beneath is more solid rock behaving plastically, not just the fluid ocean. Then you would need six and a half quadrillion tons of super glue. It's roughly a billion times the annual global production of all adhesives and resins combined. And even if you had a magic factory, manufacturing that much would release exajoules of heat rivaling that of a large nuclear arsenal. And enormous meteors slamming into it at incredible speed just to squeeze it out. This would inject enough heat into the mantle to melt the glue, vaporize seawater, and likely trigger global volcanism, giving you a magma ocean. The force would push the glue miles into the cracks, covering the edge of every continent for over 60,000 miles. So at that depth to do this, pressure would be on the order of tens of thousands of atmospheres. Any ordinary adhesive would depolymerize or carbonize. And the water would make the glue set quickly, leaving you with a massive supercontinent. We'd be better off waiting 250 million years for the Earth to give us one of these for free.